Well, I guess Efficiency Bot is busy crunching the numbers. I'll wait here for them to come back so we can talk. You can use that path to get back to the mountain shop, human, and we'll catch up with you soon. Oh, I see how it is. Yeah, I'll just vamoose and leave you two up here to smash circuits in private again. He's not sleeping, is he? I have no doubt that he is perfectly wide awake. Okay, he might be dead. What's up, guys, and welcome back to Vacation Simulator. So when we last left off, I asked you guys, what do you want to see me do next? Now, should we return to Vacation Beach and try to dig up some of the secrets that I missed there? Should we make our first trip to Vacation Forest and see what that whole third of the game is about? Or should we climb up Vacation Mountain and search for the abominable Snowbot? And unsurprisingly, the overwhelming response was search for the Snowbot. Now, here's the thing. All I ask from you two is that you shut up. Okay, you're nice and quiet now, but the last thing that I need is for your bickering to scare away my target. I can't imagine this is going to be easy. So just keep your lover's quarrel out of my video, and by the end of it, we should have a blurry photo of a virtual, mythological snow robot. Now, luckily for us, we're not going into this hunt blind, okay? Mr. Septic I bought here uh, uh, has a book called Finding Abominable Snowbot. <laughs> I'm not really sure why he's looking for proof of its existence, when he has a photo of it on the cover of his book. But either way, maybe this will help us out. Abominable Snowbot is said to live on the Overlook, but they are very shy. The only thing we've discovered about Abominable Snowbot is that they like music. Okay. So I'm gonna need two more memories before I can get up to the Overlook, and we need to find some way to play music. I don't suppose you have any more hot tips, do ya? It sure would be memorable if I had a picture to prove the existence of Abominable Snowbot. If you get one, bring it here. It's right there. It's on the cover of your own book. <laughs> Can you see through those glasses? I'm willing to bet you don't even have a septic eye. Yeah, you just got two regular eyes. You great big phony. So first things first, we need to find ourselves a couple more memories. And I don't think you have anything for us. Or you just keep saying the same Human, stupid thing. How many run-ins with Abominable Snowbot yet? Over and over again. Nope, still haven't seen him. Still working on it. Oh, right. You might be able to help us out, right? You have a little activity table that we haven't gotten to yet. What's going on over here? This is a super intense little ice Rubik's Cube. Hello! Welcome to the ice sculpting station, human. You can oh. shape this ice to your artistic vision. The sculpture is already there. It's up to you to chip it out. Or you can carve according to this blueprint. Blueprint, huh? Pane of ice. Right is all ones, and front is a line of fours. Uh, I don't think I follow. I guess worst case scenario, I screw it up and you just go get more, right? There's no shortage of ice around here. You are drawn to create, human. I love seeing the artists find the beauty in the ice block. If you want to know more about ice carving, give me a wave. Cool. Okay. What I... Oh, I just got it. Reset, reset, reset. Okay, I... Got it now. Uh, that's not what I expected. I kind of just figured you would go out there with a chainsaw and be back in a few minutes. But yeah, this works too. So it's kind of telling me what I need to carve. Right from the right, we want to see one deep. And from the front, we want to see four deep along these. So I would need to carve something like this. Yeah, like, like that? That good? Looking at it this way, they're all four deep, and looking at it this way, they're all one deep. So that should be, oh, okay, judge me. That's a great start. There are many more opportunities to show your sculpting skill, so uh, keep going. Hey, that's an easy memory. I'll take it, Ice Sculpture's one. <laughs> you have no idea, but you're actually helping me find I was about to say Bigfoot, but he probably doesn't have feet, since none of you do. 
So this time around, it's going to be symmetrical, and we want four on the top and two in the middle. So something like this, I would imagine. I know it's not a race, but I'm eager to get up to the top of the mountain. That look good? Judge me. The strength is in the foundation. You are mastering the skills of manipulation. Yeah, okay. This is a really interesting little minigame. I never did get to do the sandcastle game back on the beach, but it was probably something like this. Table flip. Oh, so it's going to be like an upside down table, maybe? Wait, this one's a little weird. We want the four on the bottom. That's going to be the top of the table. But then the legs are supposed to be... Oh, no, they're not two. This is technically two. So we want to do something like this. I'm a master ice sculptor already. I don't need to hunt Bigfoot. I'll make a name for myself here. Judge me. Two art sometimes takes us to inverted directions. Keep going. Okay. Yeah, I don't really know what that means, but I don't need to. I'm going to make myself rich and famous on ice sculptures. Cute castle. Ooh, what? Um... Okay, so four and four, and then two and two. So would it be something like that? And then nothing on top, and then nothing here? That kind of looks like a cute castle, right? Four, four, two, 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 two. Yeah, I think that's it. Matching sides. Oh, who needs them? I'm much more interested in whatever you're trying here. Is that not it? I could have swore... Oh, that's not it. I was supposed to leave a little bit. Okay, fine. Screw it. Restart. Oh, I see now. This one's actually really tricky. I need to keep four along all of the walls, but two in the middle. So to do that, I guess I need to take out the middle? Something like that? Oh, your yeah! Your is getting even better. We're building some memories here. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, I'm not going to do that anymore because I want to do some other memories, but we do have enough to get to the top of the mountain now. So everything else we do down here will be gravy. So I've become a master artiste. I've dealt with the loud Irish store owner. I have found all the mods for the nerd and throw all the snowballs at the weirdo. There might still be stuff for me to do in here. Right? I don't think- Yeah! We still have the photos to get! That's right, I completely forgot about you. I think I already took one last episode. This should go there? Yeah! Way to rock that classic winter look, human! Oh, and, uh, by the way, human, you can replace any photo on the stand. As long as it matches the original sketch. Aren't updates great? I know, right? Okay, um... I don't know if you own these or if I can rent them or something like that, but I'm going to take them because if I'm going to hunt the Abominable Snowbot, I want to make sure I can actually get a good photo of him. <laughs> so we'll just take all that for now and uh, go build a snowman. So we could go with the standard carrot for a nose, but I'm feeling sweet potato. <laughs> yeah, I want to change things up. Let's make a creative snowman. Other than a nose, I also need, what, a hat and glasses? Well, the good news is I got the perfect photo, <laughs> but the bad news is somebody's none too pleased about it. Hopefully he still gives me a memory. Oh, that is the great thing about the mountains, human. You can't make a snow human on the beach. And that's one set down. This is a fantastic start to proving my role as the primary sibling. You definitely earned this memory. Yeah, okay, mountain photos one. I think I have enough memories now, right? Like, we could make a puzzle or do some knitting, play bingo, go to bed before 8 p.m. No, no, I'm, I'm not waving at you, old lady. Shut up, okay? I'm gonna go hunt the abominable snowbot. That's enough. <laughs> enough screwing around. Let's see if we can actually get through this now. Shouldn't be any problems, right? Pass accepted. Yeah, there we go. Bot tells me gondolas were the human's most efficient way to climb mountains. Enjoy. Yay! Great job, human. We're on our way to see the rest of the mountain. Get on this gondola and throw that switch. Yeah, not sure how I feel about virtual gondolas. <laughs> okay. 
Hopefully this is a jump cut. I do not want to get shot up this mountain inside this death box. Uh... Why does it have a horn? Can these things collide with others? <laughs> That's not good. Uh, it was a jump cut. We're good. We are good. Holy crap. This is super different. Okay, uh... What's going Welcome on up to here? Overlook, human. We're really high up, but the summit is even higher. Just remember, it's about the journey. Are you... What the... What the hell? I'm not climbing that! I don't care how much of a sugar rush you give me. Make another gondola. Like, that... Cannot be real. I can't even see the top of it. It just disappears into the clouds. That has to be an attempt at humor, right? I guess there's only one way of finding out. What is this? Uh, hey. Hello, human! Are you ready to do some skiing? Grab those poles to get started. How is this skiing? Hey, lady, my ski poles don't have poles. What? What the hell? Oh, I am skiing. Kind of, right? I'm, I'm simulating skiing. This is a really clever way of doing skiing in VR. Right, because you were actually flying down a mountain, you'd be getting violently sick. This is just kind of clever. And I get a memory at 200. So, I just need to avoid creaming into all the rocks and stumps and arrows? What would the arrows do? Are they good? Usually it'd be like a speed boost, but I don't see how I can go faster on a treadmill. Okay, it's a ramp. It's a ramp. Of course it's a ramp. It sounds like I'm playing cliffhangers on The Price is Right. Come on, memory. Yeah. Oh, I get, a, I get a, another memory. Gnarly! That was some cold. Skiing, human. I can't remember ever seeing someone shred like that. But now I can. Get it? It was you. A score like that deserves a memory. Thank you. Have you seen the abominable snowbot around? If you're blasting all that yodeling, you think he'd come out of hiding, but I haven't seen anything. That's right. I need to find a way to play music up here. But I don't have anything. I guess we're gonna try for that. <laughs> what do I do here? Oh. Oh! Uh... No, I don't need any warm-up for climbing. I, I want to just get climbing. Oh, I get a memory out of this. Okay, yeah, sure, what's up? Oh, welcome, human. I hear you're ready to scale the lofty heights of rock. This is the only place on Vacation Island where you can go rock climbing that complies with our liability, our public relations department, our insurance provider, and tort reform. See how high you can make it! Okay... How does this work? Seems easy enough. Yeah, we just kind of climb our way up. Okay, okay, it just fell apart! What the Why hell? Why do we fall, human? To remind you that every time you grab a new handhold, it has to match the shape or color of the last one you grabbed. Oh, why didn't you start with that? I thought we fell to become Batman, isn't that the quote? Shape or color, huh? Alright, so... Something like this? Oh yeah, that's nice and easy. It still seems like there's gotta be some kind of catch to this, right? There's no way it could be this easy. It's not easy. It's not even a little easy. There is a catch. If you don't see a color or shape that matches, it'll start to wiggle and fall apart. You got to keep on moving and keep in mind what your current shape and color is, which is not an easy thing to do. Okay, come on. Come on. We're so... No, no, no. No, you don't. You're not getting away from me that easy. Come on. Blue... Blue up no! Great job, human! You did it! You're a certified climber! Yeah, we don't really actually certify climbers, but at least we made a fun memory. 
I mean, that's great and stuff, but I feel like I need certification to climb up Mount Everest here. <laughs> yeah, do I need to do it again? Do I need more memories or... Or can I just... Oh, I can just climb it. Yeah, I'll just... I'll, you, you hear all that? That's my struggle right now, but we'll get there together in the dark. I climbed the whole thing with my eyes closed. Hey, that was pretty it easy. like you had quite the climb. <laughs> it would have been much more efficient if we had just installed an elevator. It's not really an accomplishment if you just skip to the end. Oh. Anyway, no peak is complete until you fly your flag. Go ahead and turn that crank to raise up the flagpole. Okay. Have you guys seen the Abominable Snowbot? I completely forgot why we're here. <laughs> we can play music up here. Would he be hanging around up here, I wonder? Hey guys, I think your flag's broken. Now raise oh. that testament to human achievement up high. I see, there we go. I'm really curious what could possibly be on my flag. Oh, cool. Now you take off your hats and be sure to put your hand on your heart. Praise the sun. Okay, we did it. Now what? Now what? We did it. We climbed the highest peak on Vacation Island and flew the flag to prove it. This is so much more exhilarating than a memory. But the metrics are trending downwards. Just look at this chart. Let me see that. Are you sure it's right side up? Of course it's correct. My math coprocessor is certified at the atomic level. Maybe we aren't measuring the right things. I'm not sure. I've always been a champion at quantity. I'm going to rerun the numbers. Well, I guess Efficiency Bot is busy crunching the numbers. I'll wait here for them to come back so we can talk. You can use that path to get back to the mountain shop, human, and we'll catch up with you soon. Oh, I see how it is. Yeah, I'll just vamoose and leave you two up here to smash circuits in private again. He's not sleeping, is he? I have no doubt that he is perfectly wide awake. Okay, he might be dead. So our main issue right now is we don't have a way to play music. And neither of you two double as a CD player, do you? This one clearly doesn't, so I guess we're just going to have to go back to the shop and see if we can find some kind of radio? Wait a minute. I'm 99% sure in the first episode I saw a radio in here somewhere. Right, maybe that acts as a radio? I can actually get up into my beds! <laughs> Mode awake. Good day, human. Alright. Uh... Well, we have a timer. Okay, maybe when the timer runs out, this will play radio music. Because that would come in handy. Then it's going to be kind of like a timed Yeti grenade. <laughs> I like that they leave chocolate on my pillow and stuff like that. That's definitely appreciated. But I'm pretty sure I can take these items with me. I should... Yeah, I can take everything else with me. I never thought about that. I can transfer items between vacations. That's really weird. Okay. Not quite the music I was going for, damn it. I don't know why I'm searching the fridge for a radio. I'm just really curious what's over here. We haven't seen any of this before. I can apparently make hot drinks and <laughs> do a little work on my computer. We got Quizzer, Solitaire, Wikipedia, Botnet, Botmail. Uh, I'm afraid that if I touch any of this, I might summon the ghost of JobBot. That's the last thing that I need in my life right now. Oh, oh, here we go, here we go, radio, I see you over there. This is exactly what we're looking for, right? It looks the exact same as the one that was in the pamphlet. As long as we can get music out of it. Yeah, perfect. So you just hang out there? Do you ever feel overwhelmed by vacation activities? No. Try relaxing in front of the television, or playing some video games instead. Television, your gateway to relaxing. Okay, Video are you... Games. It's gonna Stop talk in my backpack the whole way up the mountain. That's just great. News. To start our show, we're gonna go with our new instant hit by Background Music Bot. Funk Music underscore zero five underscore seventeen oh one dot W-A-V. Such a catchy name. Okay. That's good. Right, we have music, and this is where I'm supposed to be. Uh... uh. Are you kidding me? That's it? 
<laughs> this great big hunt, and he just comes out and dances. Great, okay, well, let's go ahead and get that picture. Um, probably gonna want a telephoto lens, right? We can uh, just snap a few of you. Uh, hey, Abominable Snowbot, can I get a look over here, please? Hello? Hello, oh, oh. I think I spooked him. Oh, crap. Uh, that's a pretty good photo, right? Oh, I'm sorry. I, I, I didn't mean it. You come back. There's a whole lot more funky beats over here. <laughs> Maybe I'll take a few just in case. I wasn't sure what flavor you wanted, so I, I just got one of everything. <laughs> here you go. Yeah. Okay, he'll, he'll get that in due time. I'm gonna actually turn off the music and see what he does. Oh, there he goes. Well, we got it. I'm, I'm sure Jackie Bot will be very happy with this. Photo abominable. You were really on the ball. I didn't even get down the mountain. You already had it prepared. Can I just put that there? Yeah. Okay. Uh, you're welcome. I don't have anything to say about that. <laughs> I get the feeling he just sees all and knows all. The abominable snowbot. Who would have thought it actually exists? Other than me, of course. You already had a, a photo. I, I, I just don't get it. You know what? I think that's going to be it for this episode of Vacation Simulator, guys. And once again, I think I'm going to do another poll. You know, what do you guys want to see next? Do you want me to go back to the beach and find some of the stuff that I missed? Do you want me to see the forest for the first time? Do you want me to return here and do some of the stuff that we haven't done in the lodge? Be sure to leave a like in the video, leave a comment, let me know, vote on the poll, that kind of thing. I'll be sure to return for more Vacation Sim soon. But thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.